G'day guys, just wanted to have a quick look through this hive today. Just need to go through each one every now and then just to make sure they're set up properly. We're heading towards winter here so I need to know that they've got everything they need to, to head into winter. So the first thing is right at the front there they haven't built out all their combs couple of little sticks of foundation there which they're just ignoring they're a bit reluctant to build comb this time of year they're, they're more more keen to just use what they've got and pack honey into what they've got so this little one's a bit dry they've sort of abandoned building that one So there's a honey frame, bit of pollen in it. So I decided to put that partially built one right at the front. And I'm gonna move all this forward. Just having trouble getting that one out. I'll just get the little tool there and lever it up a bit. Once you get it started, it moves. So we're into brood there now. So you can see they're sort of building a decent band of honey across the top of their combs and but they're still raising plenty of brood. I've just wound things down a little bit in terms of the brood. You can see what I mean about any feed I give them, they're, they're more keen to actually store it above the brood there rather than build new comb. It's one thing that's a bit different about the autumn compared to the spring and summer. They're not as keen to build comb, they're more likely just to sort of pack down what they've got. So that's the third frame of brood. So I found the queen there now. So she's just the typical sort of Italian hybrid sort of queen that I I make with my grafting. Not the biggest queen you've ever seen, but she's doing a decent job in here anyway. So the brood looks nice and healthy. It does look spotty, but this time of year there's just a bit of pollen and a bit of honey and all sorts all mixed in the brood combs and the queen never really gets a chance to just lay a whole big patch of brood at once. 
So that's why all these brood combs look a bit patchy the way they do. So we decided to put a foundation in there, sort of in the middle of the brood nest. I want to try and force them to draw it out. Another brood comb there, so. Yeah, I think there's six in total. Six brood combs in total. And this one's just honey at the back there, so. They sort of delineate the brood nest with a frame of honey in stores at one end and the other. And then just concentrate the brood nest on those few combs in the middle. So I decided to put another foundation in here. Just trying to make up my mind what I'm doing. I'll put it in there and um, it's nice and close to the feeder then and I reckon they'll be a bit more inclined to work on it when it's sitting there near the feeder rather than those couple that were right at the front of the box and they weren't they weren't doing anything with those. I haven't been feeding a lot to be honest. Just every now and then I put a bit in here but now that I've put these two foundations in there I'll I'll feed them right up. Thanks guys.